Basketball is a very interesting sport, which is composed of three different sports, which are hockey, football, and soccer. Basketball was played with nine players on each team originally, with a soccer ball and a peach basket hoop. But now it's played with a basketball and a basket with metal rims and glass backboards. It used to, the peach basket used to be nailed onto the wall, and it didn't have a hole in it. So every time you, every time you had to climb up on a ladder and pick the ball out of the basket, which would be annoying. So then he, Joe Naismith, the creator, who created basketball in 1891, when he was supposed to create a recreational activity that was played outdoors, no, played indoors while it was winter. So what he did is he just cut a hole through the bottom of the peach basket. So you didn't have to have a jump ball every time a team scored. So therefore you just, every time the ball went through the basket, uh, you had to inbound the ball from out of bounds, which is the baseline, and then play just kept on playing and you didn't have to stop it every two minutes. Although shooting a layup may look easy when performed by a skilled basketball player, it is quite difficult when you focus in on the little things and to perform the perfect technique. In order to have the perfect technique, you have to have many different steps. First, you need to learn how to dribble so you can get to the basket. So to dribble, you have to pump, you have to dribble the ball, and you have to bend your knees a little, and then you have to push the ball down onto the ground pretty hard, and then it comes right back up to you, and you just need to practice that a little. And then once you're able to do that, you can go on to the actual layup itself. But you have to be able to dribble while moving, and you have to come up to the basket. And then you have to, you can shoot left, right, or middle. It doesn't matter, but right now I'm gonna perform a left hand leg. So I need to jump off of my right leg, and I need to extend my uh, left leg into the air like this. While when I'm doing that, I need to extend my left arm up to the basket and my right arm is just to keep the ball in place. So if you were doing the layup, you would dribble up, come up, perform that technique, get a little, little jump, and then you need to flick the ball softly into the basket off of the backboard. You want to shoot it off about the top part of that blue square in the backboard. So it would look sort of like this. When I was younger, I was in a semifinal in a tournament. We were playing and we were down by one. The opposing team had the ball. They shot a three-pointer, which hit off the back of the rim and like flew to the three-point line on their side of the court in which I was waiting to grab it. So I grabbed the ball, I looked up, and there was only one player from the opposing team back on defense. So I took advantage of the situation and I grabbed the ball, turned around, started dribbling to my right. He was right on my hip. So I crossed over to my left hand I started dribbling as fast as I could down the court. And then when I got to about the 3.9, I did a hesitation move, came up to the basket, he's still on my hip. I come up for the left-handed layup with, there's still about 30 seconds left, and I shoot the shot. And I shoot it too far and miss. The other team got the rebound, and we had to foul him. And they ended up winning the game by three points because I missed that layup. And we didn't win the tournament because of it. If I had the proper technique when shooting that layup, I would have probably made it and we would have probably gone on to the championship. And who knows, we could have won. But it's very important to have the proper technique. When I could go back and shoot that layup. 
I would aim for the top left square on, on the backboard like I'm supposed to. But knowing the proper technique of a layup teaches you the basics of basketball and ultimately allows you to play with friends if, even if you don't play basketball on a team.